Okay, so let's just settle into a nice, comfortable, seated posture. And if your feet are down on the ground, have them about a hips, hips width apart. Hmm. I'm listed on Friday, am I? Oh, okay. All right. Shoulders are aligned with the hips. And imagine you have this spine, which is just a string of pearls of light stretching from the base all the way up through the crown of the head and beyond. Just lengthen the spine. Imagine the string of light is going out to infinity. And then just bring your attention to the crown of your head and release any tension there. Allow some softening. Allow some softening into the face. the temples, the jaw, the back of the head, and just relax your shoulders and shoulder blades down. The throat, the chest, and the belly, and all of your limbs. And then just bring the mind to the breath and notice the sensation of the air as you're inhaling and exhaling. And then be aware if there are any sounds in your environment and just allow them to be there. Just allow the sounds to be there. Trying not to follow with the mind. And then notice thoughts that are arising in the mind. And try and put some space in between those thoughts. And then if you wish, you can maybe label what it is you're thinking. So some thoughts could be arising, such as, you can just keep it really simple and go, oh, I'm thinking, or I'm processing. And then bring to mind all the people of your life. And I, I'm 
you know, just be curious as to, you know, these different groups that we've got going, whether they're actually the people in them are changing place, the ones you love, the ones who are strangers to you, and the ones you don't like so much. And they're all equal and they wish to be happy, they wish to be free from suffering and in having this extraordinary capacity for Buddhahood. So think there is no negativity that can't be purified. So just allow that thought to settle in the mind while we, you know, think about doing this practice will motivate all these people of our life for ourselves and all sentient beings. There is no negativity. It can't be purified. So if you're placing a judgment, say, for example, on the person you don't like, that's good to keep in mind. We have lots of opinions about things, about people. So we create negativity with our minds so equally we can create positivity as well so we start with the power of regret so sincerely regret from the depths of your heart anything you have done to harm any living being on this day in this life and in all of our past lives and think of specific actions of both your body and your speech and then in general regret all and the reason to regret is based on this logic of karma we experience everything due to our past karma, our past actions, and having harmed others, we ourselves will necessarily experience suffering in the future. And we cannot bear the thought of the future suffering that we will experience. We know from our present suffering we don't want any more, so logically it makes sense to remove the karmic seeds before they ripen as future suffering for us. So think like this. I regret from the depths of my heart having harmed others with my body and my speech, having broken my vows because I do not want the future suffering. I'm sick of suffering. And also regret any anger, attachment and the rest that are the cause of why we harm others. And then think again, I'm sick of this suffering. And then think, what can I do about it? Whom can I turn to? So here we come to the power of reliance. So we rely upon this... Uh, Buddha Vajrasapa. So first of all, we take we take refuge in this Buddha Vajrasapa. In the same way that you would take refuge in your doctor if you weren't very well, or you would want to find something or someone uh, to make you better. So you seek refuge in that. So you know we're looking this Buddha. We don't want necessarily to be forgiving us. You know it's already a, a, a it's already taken for granted that you know not taken for granted but it's always a, already a given Vajrasattva is completely accepting you of uh, who you are so there's no need for forgiveness this whole point is that we're using uh, Vajrasattva's methods to heal ourselves so you imagine Vajrasattva above the crown of your head you can also imagine this is your teacher manifesting in this form for your benefit and he's made of radiant blissful white light sitting cross-legged on a white lotus and a moon cushion. He has a beautiful radiant face. His eyes are long and peaceful and full of love and compassion for you and all those people of your life. He has a sweet red mouth. His hair is black and held up in a top knot. His arms are crossed at his heart, the left underneath the right. The left is holding a bell representing wisdom. The right is holding a vajra, which represents the indestructibility of compassion and their being crossed represents the union of these two, and this symbolizes enlightenment itself, the development of infinite wisdom and infinite compassion. To the Buddha, the Dharma, and the Sangha, I go for refuge until I'm enlightened. By this practice of meditating on Guru Vajrasattva, may I reach Buddhahood so as to benefit all sentient beings. 
So in order to develop compassion, we need to rely upon other beings, the very beings we have harmed and those who have harmed us by developing compassion for them. So think particularly of people you've harmed recently and in the past and then in general, all beings we have ever harmed since the beginning of time. And then think about those who have harmed you and have compassion for them because the harm they've caused you is going to result in suffering for them sort of later on. So make a strong aspiration. We do this practice of purification for the sake of all these beings and think I must purify for their sake. So um, now we come to the power of the remedy and this is the actual medicine doing this practice of purification and we start with the body. So imagine Vajrasattva sending powerful white nectar like coming out of a hose quite forcefully from his heart and it arcs around and enters your crown and pours into your entire body filling you completely it keeps pouring into you until it forces out of your lower orifices all the harm you have ever done to any living being with your body in the form of inky liquid and this pours out of you and disappears into space not one atom left as we recite the mantra Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dido Meboa Sutukaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anaracta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sitsa Me Sitam Shriam Guru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hompe Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dido Meboa Sutukaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta me boa, sawa sidi me be yatta sawa, kama sita me, sitam shiam kuru hum, ha 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 ho, bagoan, sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa, mahasamaya sata a humpe, and vajrasapa samaya, manupalaya, vajrasapa dina patita, dida me boa, sitokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa, anarakta me boa, sawa sidi me be yatta sawa, kama sita me, sitam shiam kuru hum, ha 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 ho, bagoan, Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa mahasamaya sata a humpe. And vajrasapha samaya manupalaya vajrasapha dina patita. Dida me boa, sutokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa. Anarakta me boa, sawa sidi me piyatsa sawa kama sita me. Sitam shiyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa mahasamaya sata a humpe. And Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dida me boa, Sutukaya me boa, Sipokaya me boa, Anarakta me boa, Sawa Sidi me piyatsa sawa kama sita me, Sitam shiyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan, Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sata a humpe. And Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dida me boa, Sutukaya me boa, Sipokaya me boa, Anarakta me boa, sawa sidi me be yatsa sawa kama sita me, sitam shiyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan, sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sata a humpe, and vajrasapha samaya manupalaya vajrasapha dina patita, dida me boa, sutokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa, anarakta me boa, sawa sidi me be yatsa sawa kama sita me, Sitam shiyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe. So be delighted that all the harm you've ever done to any sentient being with your body is now completely purified and think that there's no way you could do anything but benefit others now with your body. And next is a purification of our speech. And Vajrasattva very happily sends powerful nectar from his heart chakra and it arcs around and forcefully enters your crown and fills your entire body, except this time forcing up to the top of your body all the negativity of your speech, and this overflows and disappears into space, not one atom left. So you just imagine all the gossip and the harsh speech and the useless speech and lying and talking about others behind their backs. All of this is purified by this powerful nectar filling you as you recite the mantra. Om Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dida me boa, Sutokaya me boa, Sipokaya me boa, Anarakta me boa, Sawa Sidi me piyatsa sawa, Kama Sita me, Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum, Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan, Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama me Mutsa Vajrabawa, Maha Samaya Sata A Humpe, 
and Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Tidu Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anorakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe and Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Tidu Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anorakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe and Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dita Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anorakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe And Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dita Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anorakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe and Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dita Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anorakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Skuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe and Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dita Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anorakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe So again, feel so happy that your speech is now completely purified and imagine it's not possible to do anything but benefit others now with your speech. And next is the purification of the mind. And Vajrasattva very compassionately sends powerful beams of light from his heart chakra and this arcs around and enters your crown and fills your entire being. So it's the same as when you, you know, you walk into a dark room, you flick on the switch and the light dispels the darkness. So the light from Vajrasattva's heart hits your heart chakra and all the darkness of the negativity of your mind, all your attachment and neediness, bitterness, anger, grudges, all of this instantly dispelled as the light hits your heart chakra. Just try and imagine that for a moment. You might, you might not actually be, you know, feeling it, but just try and imagine it. The first step is to imagine it, visualize it, try and get it intellectually, and then from there move to try and feel it. As we recite the mantra again. Om Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anorakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Om Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anorakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Om Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anorakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Om Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anorakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Om Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anorakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me 
Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha Ha Ho Bhagavan Sawatata Gata Vajama Mimutsa Vajabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Ambhadra Safa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Safa Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Siddhi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sitsa Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha Ha Ho Bhagavan Sawatata Gata Vajama Mimutsa Vajabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe and Bajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Bajrasapha Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawasiddhi Mimpiyatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe So be delighted that all your delusions which are the source of all of our own suffering and the cause of why we harm others with our body and our speech are completely purified and think now there's no space in your heart for anything other than love and kindness and forgiveness and wisdom and bliss and compassion. So next is the purification of the imprints of negativity of the body, speech and mind. And you can imagine Bhajrasattva sending light and nectar and it fills you completely and eradicates even the subtlest imprints of negative energy. As we recite the mantra again. Am Bhajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Siddhi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Am Bhajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Siddhi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Am Bhajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Bhajrasapha Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Siddhi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Am Bhajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Siddhi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Am Bhajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Bhajrasapha Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Siddhi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha Ha Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Am Bhajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Bhajrasapha Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Siddhi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha Ha Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Am Bhajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Bhajrasapha Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Siddhi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe so now feel you're completely purified. There's not one atom of negativity left in your mind stream. Even the subtlest obscurations to your enlightenment have been removed. And now we come to the power of resolve. And this is the fourth and final step in the purification process. And it's a really crucial one. This is this determination to not harm with our body and our speech and our mind, or to at least to think about refraining from harming with our body, speech and mind. And without this determination, we're just going to keep doing the same old stuff over and over again. So this determination, this aspiration to not harm is like a beacon that guides our body, speech and mind in new directions. So think of something, well, first of all, rejoice in your efforts. You know, all of you have been coming here now so long. 
so consistently. So really, it's amazing. It's quite a commitment. So rejoice for that and each other. And then think about something you'd like to work on, perhaps. Maybe it's rumination. Maybe it's anger. Maybe it's, you know, eating too many chocolate chip cookies. And then think Vajrasattva's delighted with us and wanting to merge with your mind melts into white light and absorbs into you through your crown. And think my teacher's body, speech, and mind, Vajrasattva's body, speech, and mind, and my own body, speech, and mind are the same. And next, Rinpoche would recommend uh, meditating on the emptiness of the three circles. In emptiness, there is no I, the creator of negative karma. There is no action of creating negative karma and there is no negative karma created. So at whatever level uh, you understand emptiness, place your mind there for a little while. We can think of all phenomena as being empty. They do not exist from their own side. We can also think that the way things appear to me might not necessarily be the way they actually exist. So let's just dedicate all the merit, all the positive energy you've created doing this practice to all living beings and think May all the virtuous karma I've created from doing this practice ripen as my enlightenment for the sake of sentient beings as quickly as possible. And then let's just um, think strong wish for His Holiness the Dalai Lama to live long, to be able to continue to teach for the swift return of Lama Saprimbishe and then for all of your own, you know, your own personal teachers. Some of them may be Western, some of them may not be, some of them may be Geshis, some of them may be Western Geshis, some of them may be, you know, Tibetan Geshis, Nepali Geshis, some of them may be just a, an ordinary person who is your teacher. Okay, all right, lots of love everybody, and I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you so very much, thanks for hosting.